Hi, this is Rod Richardson here. Uh, William and I are going to demonstrate how you uh, do a prospecting approach to get people to play the residual income game with you. So to set the stage for a little bit, let's imagine that we are out at a networking event and we're mingling and that William and I don't know each other. And so as I approach William, I might, uh, uh, if we're at a mixer or an event or something, I might come up and say, Hi, how are you? Hey, I'm doing great. How are you doing? Good. My name's Rob Richardson. What's your name? William. William Black. William. William, what do you do? Well, I'm actually a CPA, so I help people with accounting and tax returns, that kind of thing. Oh, that's excellent. What kind of people are you looking for? Um, well, I'm just looking for clients, really. I'm just looking for uh, people that, can, uh, that I can do work for that maybe need accounting help, that kind of thing. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. What about you? What, what, what do you do? Oh, I'm glad you asked. I'm glad you asked. I, uh, I work with the Mastermind Group. We get together and we teach each other how to make money. Really? It's, uh, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. We run a club. Matter of fact, it's open. Would you like to be invited sometime? Sure. Sure. Awesome. Well, if you've got a card, I'll give, you, I'll give you a call next time we have an event. See, I've got one right there. Oh, awesome. awesome. Can I get your card? Sure, you bet. Here's my card. Thank you. Yeah. In fact, I may know some people, too, that may benefit uh, your accounting firm, and some of the people there may be able to actually use your services. Oh, that'd be awesome. I appreciate that very much. It's great. Well, we'll be in touch. So what I want you to realize there is from that approach, you'll notice that I didn't, uh, I didn't approach William directly. I paid attention to his interests first. And the magic word in that type of approach is to say, what do you do? How may I help you? What are you looking for? And as a result, eventually, if William's interested, he's going to ask me. Eventually, he'll ask me what it is that I do, and it'll open the door. Uh, if he doesn't, then that's okay. That's okay. Next time I see William, I'll ask him how his firm's doing, and eventually he'll ask me. And so that's, uh, that's one of our first key secrets. To now, the next part is, uh, now that we've received a list of contacts from our networking meeting, maybe we'll, have a, maybe we'll have a group of business cards that we've gathered from different events, from people where we've met some folks. And so now let's, uh, let's take a moment and uh, demonstrate how that follow-up might go. And so we met, uh, we met William at our mixer, so we'll, uh, we'll give William a call. Yeah, is this William? William, how are you? This is Rob Richardson. You and I met at that, uh, that mixer here a while back. Yeah. Yeah, as a matter of fact, uh, I just uh, told you when we met uh, that I was going to give you a call the next time that group was getting together. Yeah, that's right. So anyway, I just wanted to let you know that uh, this Friday at 7 p.m., there's a group of us that are going to get together. We're going to have, uh, we're gonna have some pizza and some drinks. And uh, just thought maybe you'd like to come down and join us. Yeah, it's at 7 o'clock. Yeah, it's down at the address on the card that I gave you. So you think you'll be able to make it? Well, awesome. Hey, uh, if there's someone else you know that might be interested, you're perfectly welcome to bring, bring a guest. Is there somebody else you can think of? Oh, that'll be awesome. Yep, they're, they're perfectly welcome. That it's a totally open event, you know, it's in a public space, uh, it, it'll be great, it'll be great. Awesome, well, we'll look forward to seeing you there. You bet, thank you, William. Bye. So it's pretty much that easy. It's just asking people, what we're asking them is non-threatening. Uh, when they come, they'll be exposed to the industry. Uh, they'll have kind of a view of uh, a really good understanding of how uh, the industry of network marketing and direct selling work. And at that point, if they demonstrate interest during that, uh, during that gameplay, then I'll bring up the question. I'll say, hey, how would you, like, how would you guys like to see how, how I do this in real life? And so, so I hope this helps. Um, inviting people to play the residual income game is really simple, really easy. And it's an innocuous way to expose people to the industry so that they're not all held up by myths uh, and, and other objections. It, it overcomes so many things and it, it positions people so that they, you can find out if they're really going to be good business builders for you. So anyway, till next time, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Rod Richardson. We'll talk to you later.